Okay. And where was your real dad at the time? My real dad was on the east side. Oh, so he was around. <laughs> yeah, he was around. Yeah. Okay. Streets gotta eat. Streets gotta eat. Streets gotta eat. Streets gotta eat. to say bad shit about people. <laughs> Vlad, I love Vlad. Vlad, I like Vlad because he make interview get people in trouble. He like to get people in big trouble, especially black people. He does. <laughs> Vlad is sneaky. So what's going on streets gotta eat fam it's your man online bill money tapping in with another video go ahead and smash that like go ahead and subscribe hit the notification bell for me i appreciate your participation thanks for tuning in um this video is going to be brief and um just to point out um you know dj vlad is back on his bullshit um as always and this was something that i just um commented about um, in a live panel discussion with Kwame Brown um, We were talking about Vlad And I pointed out the fact that Vlad Always um, Asks You know The typical or stereotypical uh, Questions uh, To black people when he had them on the platform And one of the main things He wants to know Especially if you come from the hood um, Is whether you had a two parent household With a mom and a dad um, in this clip, I'm going to go ahead and uh, what I, which I am reacting to um, was on a recent interview he had with Tanisha Welch, who goes by the moniker um, the First Lady of BMF. Um, I guess she was Terry Flournoy's lady um, at one time. Southwest T uh, from Black Mafia Family. And, you know, Vlad wants to delve into her background. And he asked her about her upbringing. And she mentioned the fact that she was raised in a uh, middle-class household with her mom, her stepdad, and three brothers. Um, Vlad wanted to chime in and ask her about her real dad. She said, oh, he was across town. And Vlad was very surprised. And I wish I had every clip. Um, I'm sorry, I'm not, I should create a compilation of clips um, in which he um, shows surprise when he's hit with the fact that a, a guest had a mom and a dad in the household and, and this just goes to show to me um you know that vlad is interested in um crafting a narrative or uh, pushing the mainstream narrative um on black people um particularly in the inner city um you know the poverty trope the single mom upbringing um the absentee the absentee dad um preferably on drugs or in prison or dead um, the life of crime you know growing up slinging drugs yada 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 this is the narrative um, that Vlad is interested in maintaining um, he didn't create it um, but he definitely um, lends a hand to perpetuating it and to maintaining it you know he has a large audience um, several million um, subscribers and in this uh, particular realm on YouTube um, he is the biggest platform uh, so he does have a large reach so I just wanted to point this out you know <clears throat> the devil's in the details and most people miss um, these little nuance and they're not really that nuanced if you ask me they're pretty pretty glaring but I guess they go over most people's head because you know they're not focusing on the details they just had to be entertained um they're not really thinking critically and i only look at vlad in a critical um with a critical uh or uh what do you call it a critical third eye so you know i'm gonna go ahead and play the clip um you guys get down in the comment section let me know what you think and once again, before you go, hit that like button on this video, subscribe to the channel, and make sure you hit the notification bell so that you'll be alerted whenever I drop new content. 
This is your man online, Bill Money, signing off, and I'll see you on the other side. You were born in Detroit. Yes. Born and raised uh, on the west side of Detroit. The west side. Yes. Okay, at the time, the west side was more kind of like middle class. Yes. I was born into a middle class family, lived with my three brothers, my mom and my stepdad. Okay, and where was your real dad? My real dad was on the east side. Oh, so he was around. <laughs> yeah, he was around. Yeah. Okay.